What's going on today guys, DJ Static here, back with another video. And today is actually gonna be one of the hardest reviews that I am gonna do on a RDA. And the RDA I'm gonna be reviewing is the Capstone RDA. I do have the packaging laid out in front of me just so I could show you guys and throw it. But it's the Capstone RDA by Vandy Vape. Now, when this RDA was released, I was very, very excited to get it. And I did get my hands on it. Um, and it took me a while to make this video simply because I got it earlier, but simply because I didn't know how I felt about it. I showed it to different people that were equally excited about it and they didn't even know how they felt about it. I'm not going to say any names or anything like that, nor this is, if this seems like it, I'm not bashing Vandy Vape at all. I love everything that they've ever come out with and I do love the capstone. It's just a very difficult thing for me to get used to personally and if anybody's watching this and is looking to get into an RDA I would look into something else or you know if you want to jump head first into it by all means do you do whatever you want to do but the capstone RDA by Vandy Vape is you know obviously what I'm going to be reviewing and I am using it on my Bassium Squonk so I mean we're going to get into it. We're going to get into what's in the box. We're going to get into a lot of pros and cons. And then we're going to see how it performs after all the pros and cons. So without further ado, let's get into the video. So I know in the Dead Rabbit video, I had my hand showing. I work a lot and make all my videos like when I get out of work. So I do have time to wash my hands and wash up like and stuff like that. But sometimes, you know, dirt and stuff. Don't really leave your fingernails, and I just rushed some of my videos, so I'm going to kick it back to the old school and just show you guys what came in the box and everything like that. So, starting off, we do have the sleeve that it comes in, which you can see it looks like two RDAs, but we'll get into that. So, it's the sleeve, the housing that holds everything, and as you can see, I do have an O-ring in the box. We'll get into it. Certification of Authenticity by Vandy Vape. Uh, mouthpiece. Your capstone cover, which as you could see, if I could just rip this out, it has a staggered airflow. Now we're going to get into a big con in that in just a moment. So that's the capstone shield with a, or a capstone sleeve with a, another mouthpiece or drip tip. The airflow is a triangle, which, I mean, the whole RDA rep represents a triangle. It did come with fused Clapton coils, which runs at a 0.3 or a 0.28. We're going to get into that also. Spare parts bag. And the other cover is a see-through cap, which I do like, but we'll get into that as well. And last but not least, I couldn't unscrew it from my squonk, so I left it on there with the coils that I made in it, which is just like a basic 6 or 8 wrap, and it reads at 0.13, which is what I normally run at. This is the capstone itself. So, while I have it up in the screen, you can see these little holes. Let's focus, focus. You can see these little holes right here. Come on, and if I squeeze my squonker... It does drip down onto the coil. Now, I don't know why it's not focusing. Focus. All right, whatever. Needless to say, it drips from the top and goes down on the coils. So that I'm going to get into in just a second. And I just actually hit it. The instruction manual in various languages. So I'm going to fix my lighting and everything like that. And I will get back to you guys on the pros and cons of this RDA. So pros and cons of this RDA. We're going to start with the pros first. One pro, Vandy Vape made it. Anything that Vandy Vape touches turns to gold. So, I mean, if it, if Vandy Vape didn't make this, I wouldn't have bought it. So, just a disclaimer on that. Another pro is the style of it. I do like the way that it looks. With the gold even, I do have the the see-through mouthpiece on it. Which reminds me, I do have to put another see-through mouthpiece on something, but I can't name it because I forgot the name right now, but that doesn't matter. Another pro, the squonking on it is is pretty good. I'll give it that. I like the top, like the top fill squonking on it because it does drip on the cotton and on the coils better. 
um, another pro they do give you a lot of options with another drip tip another cap and obviously the main cap another pro another pro uh, is the staggered airflow so as I twist it it actually staggers it kind of like a staircase which I do like and the airflow obviously another pro since it is right there I do love mid or top airflow really don't like bottom airflow just because it does leak a lot but I mean it's good with me and then another pro it does come with coils so if you're just jumping into the RDA scene like I said this might not be for you but if you are it does come with coils so all you have to do is clip it and drop it in um, another pro it does come with a lead clipper it's just a roller that you drop the um the coils in and you clip it on the bottom they do have pictures on the website i actually lost mine because i i'm an idiot but that's another pro so those are the pros and let's get into the cons with the capstone rda by vandy vape so a big con that i had which a lot of people are going to think i'm ridiculous for doing or i probably just clipped my leads too long but the top cap with the airflow where the coils sit if you guys could see that where the coils sit the cap actually sits not really right up against it but they do sit pretty close and with the fused claptons that they give you they do they are a thicker gauge so as i was trying to twist it off I actually twisted the airflow and it kinked and ri utterly ripped these coils right out of the um, the holder on the RDA. So that's another con that I had. That's one con that I had. Another con is the O-rings on these things, guys, is way too tight for me. Like I said, I was trying to turn it and it just, I overpowered it and just ripped my coils and the cotton clean out of the RDA so I just went with a basic stainless steel wrap and I mean on the Bassium it you know it does work pretty good another con that I have is this top flow squonking I know that was a pro but it is also a con if you squonk it too much it will legitimately just fall right out of the RDA and all over your mod that happened to me quite a lot but I did get the hang of it but I mean, it's still a pain in the butt. Another thing is, another con is, I don't know if you guys can see it, but there's a lot of condensation buildup and a lot of juice buildup on this Capstone RDA, which I personally hate because I'm a stickler with cleaning my mods. And I don't know if you guys could see on the inside, but I mean, I probably took two pulls off this thing the whole day and I cleaned it yesterday, but that's another con. Um, Another other con is the see-through glass that they give you does not really fit on the RDA. And I'll show you guys right now. I actually had to take an O-ring out for it to fit. But, I mean, it fits good now. But when you have the other O-ring on it, it just kind of just sits there and still leaks out of the RDA. But, I mean, that's enough. That's enough RDA bashing. So, let's squonk this up and see how she performs. And that'll be the end of the video. Oh, you can see me. So, I forgot to say, I am vaping only at 80 watts, and I am using Country Clouds Cornbread Pudding, which you can conveniently find at Sunny Vapes in Howell or Ocean, New Jersey. But the vapor production from this thing, when you really get it working, fine-tune it and everything like that, the vapor production and the flavor from this thing is phenomenal. That's another pro, and I wanted to save that for this part of the video. But I mean, when you squawk it, get it ready, get it tight, right, and everything like that, it is a good RDA. I'm not bashing Vandy Vape. Like I said, I have probably almost every RDA that they came out with in the end of 2017 and 18. So I mean, they're good in my book. It's just the, the capstone is just very, very hard to get used to at first. But once you get the hang of it, it's a very good RDA. Um, the only reason um, why I stopped using it in these past two days is because I've been using my Bonza and Druga. I cycle through three different RDAs that sit in my bag. But, I mean, all in all, this RDA is really good. I did get this off Vandy Vape's website. And also, 
I did get my Bassium from Sunny Vapes in Howell, New Jersey. And I will have a video review on that in a little bit. But guys, I really do hope you like this video. And don't forget the Static Vapes t-shirts are still on sale. The price dropped to 20 bucks. So if you do want one, leave a comment down below or message me on Instagram. And also the new Static Heavy Artillery mix is out now. So please go peep that if you guys are into that heavy, dirty, trap, rhythm, dubstep type stuff. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.